7 was over the scene where the police found the body of 22 year old Catherine Blovelt. She was found in the cellar of this abandoned home on Main Street about 1 o'clock in the morning. Police say her family had reported her missing just hours earlier Tuesday afternoon. We'll go to our Addie Hampton now, who has been covering this all day, because Addie, we know police just held a news conference. What is the latest? Well, Gordon Blauvelt was last seen leaving her job on the Woodruff Road PetSmart Monday afternoon around 2, uh, two o'clock. She was last heard from driving in her car that same afternoon. Now, you mentioned that Air 7 video. I want to show it again. You can see this area surrounding this abandoned home. This was a hard recovery, but police say some of her friends remembered this home as a high school hangout spot. They went there mid around midnight this morning when they found her and called police. Moore said they have a few leads, but they have no defined person of interest just yet. Now, he said Blauvelt was married, but estranged from her husband. However, they said they have been in contact with that husband today. They have not yet interviewed him as a potential suspect. Right now, he said they really need to find her missing car. We are looking for any information about the whereabouts of that car. Uh, we believe that the car uh, would hold evidence, you know, that we could use in this case. Um, but uh, so far, we haven't been able to find it. And we want to let you know what this car looks like. It is a 2011 black Ford Fiesta with the tag number NMNY588. Again, MNY588. If you know anything, if you've seen this car or you've heard anything, you are urged to call the Simpsonville Police Department. I'm reporting live tonight in Simpsonville. Addie Hampton, 7 News.